welcome to today's extra edition of the Hillbilly Files. We were over here doing another video and I thought I'd bring you down here and show you this. Believe it or not, I brought you guys here once before. You don't know about it. <laughs> Somewhere between the line, between here and the house, the, the video, the footage got deleted, got lost, something happened. I'm not exactly sure what happened, but check this out. Check out this view from up here. Now this is called the Pikeville Cut Through. Uh, this was the, the brainchild of, uh, uh, it's a WMC Hambly. And um, the, the unique thing about this, this is called the Little Pikeville, Kentucky. It's called the little town that could, you know, just like the train, right? But uh, the uh, Mr. Hambly, he actually had a dream. You see the town, they had a big problem. And the problem with that was, is, you know, back in the day, you're talking old steam locomotives, coal fired, and it was just very smoky, very sooty. And here's the, show you this real quick, and I'll get back to my story. Uh, this cut through project was the dream of Dr. W.M.C. Hambly. It's the largest engineering feat in the United States and the second in the world, second only to the Panama Canal. It was started in 1973 and finished in 1987 at a cost of $77.5 million. Um, 18 million cubic yards of earth were moved. The project eliminated the disastrous flooding of the Big Sandy River by moving a four-lane highway, uh, a railroad, and a river, uh, and diverting all of them to go around the town. But the town, they would get, you know, all sooty and all this kind of stuff when the train would go through and just be, you know, it's just a big old mess and the river flooding, of course. So what uh, Mr. Hambly, his idea, his suggestion, and everyone said the man was crazy. They thought he was crazy because like you read, this is the second largest engineering feat in, you know, history. I mean, you know, second only the Panama Canal, right down in there. If you remember the Poor Farm Cemetery video, the Poor Farm Cemetery is right there on the other side of that hill. You can see how deep this thing is. This was a massive, massive undertaking. Um, the articles that we read said that uh, when Mr. Hamley first suggested this, that he was laughed out of the meeting because it was just such a massive like i said that's the only word i can think of it was just such a huge 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 undertaking to move this much this much material but they wound up they made the town bigger Hicksville, kentucky and they expanded the town the road right there that goes up that way that was actually the old riverbed and uh, you go all the way up around town and it circles all the way back around behind that mountain right there the whole thing and they made a whole bunch of uh you know new flat land that kind of thing but it turned out to be a huge boom you know for the for the whole community just by you know by doing this right here and the man was right you know he got laughed at but he was right kind of funny isn't it you know they there's a fine line between crazy and genius. Don't take much to step over it either, does it? <laughs> but anyhow, like I said, I just thought I'd bring you guys up here and show you this. We were, like I said, we were coming back near here. Not exactly, but we were coming close enough to where I wanted to come up and reshoot this for you. Check this view out. But you can come up here and look off of it. They've got, uh, they're putting up a little welcome center. They, they just put this in not long ago. That building there, you can come up. I think they do like lunches and stuff and food and you can stay there. But yeah, amazing project. Just human determination. 
you know, right there. How y'all doing? <laughs> it's kind of kind of proves the point. Like I said, there's a fine line between crazy and genius. Sometimes a crazy guy ain't so crazy after all, is he? Ah. <laughs> Present company included. <laughs> Pays to be crazy every now and then. Figured I'd come up top real quick, show you the view from up here. This is the lodge that I just showed you. Look at that view. I got the cage over there. Let's get a picture here. Now that's a pretty good view. Yeah. <laughs> 